Hello, and thank you for purchasing a center partition system from FG Products. Let's take a moment to summarize what a center partition system is before we move on to proper usage and handling. A center partition system is a series of interlocking insulated panels that divide a vehicle lengthwise. We also incorporate half-size insulated bulkheads to close off the lanes, separating product into different temperature zones. Each center partition panel fits into a floor trough and a ceiling trough that hold each panel into position. They interlock using two different extrusions, an H-shaped extrusion at the front of every panel and a bullet-shaped extrusion at the rear of every panel. Each center partition system is custom designed to meet your specific needs. It will match up with your refrigeration system, your loading and unloading practices, as well as your load mix. This will create literally a thousand different combinations or configurations of a center partition system. Fortunately, you only need to know a few basic principles to use your center partition system safely and efficiently. One of the great benefits of a center partition system is its flexibility. As load requirements change from day to day or even within the day, the wall can be reconfigured to meet your needs. Now, that brings about moving a center partition panel. So, we've placed two ergonomically located handles that are spring-loaded so that everything is flush and nothing scrapes by in each panel on each side. By lifting up, pushing the panel away from you, I can then slide this over to the wall. And in this trailer, we have a storage trough that I've lifted it into. The panel can remain here for the rest of the day or until it's needed again to make the wall longer. To put the panel back in the wall, I'm going to apply just the reverse of what we did to put it into the storage trough. I like to hold on out on the sides for this because it gives me more stability. Just like that. Simply slide the panels together to create a wall. This rear panel has a locking bar on it that prevents the panels from separating as the trailer or truck body goes down the road. This particular locking bar is pressure limited, so you cannot over jack the bar causing damage to the ceiling. FG recommends strongly that all end panels have a locking bar on them. Now as I mentioned before, there's a thousand or more different combinations or configurations that can be made with a center partition system. That's because we have all different kinds of panels and half bulkheads to make up those configurations. We can have narrow panels or wider panels to give you the exact wall length that you need. We can have short sections of logistic track or long sections of logistic track. The long section giving you exact positioning of your bulkheads. We also have panels with pass-through doors so that you can access product on the other side from this lane. This flex light has a multiple height flip top that allows the bulkhead to be used underneath a roll-up door cavity where the ceiling is actually shorter and then also forward of the roll-up door cavity where the bulkhead needs to be taller. Another common bulkhead on a center partition system is this tough boy with walk-through door. This door can be outfitted with a strip curtain or with a spring closure to keep the cold air in at all times. Operationally, there's a few things that we can do to ensure that the products are held at the proper temperature and to improve the longevity 
and reduce damage to your center partition system. With respect to product temperature, always make sure that your center partition system panels are pushed tightly together and that the rear locking bar is firmly in place. When it comes to an insulated bulkhead, obviously make sure that the bulkhead is clipped into position. And the straps are holding it tightly in place to ensure a proper seal all the way around. A bulkhead that is designed for a particular application is always labeled as such. This flex light is identified as a curbside model because of the storage trough slots in the compression seal. If I were to use a roadside bulkhead on this side of the vehicle, the storage trough would push down the compression seal, causing an air gap and allowing cold air to come down over the top of product in this back compartment. Likewise, with the bulkhead in the shortened or lowered height position, there are also slots here for the storage trough that would be located underneath the false ceiling cavity for a roll-up door. Now when it comes to prolonging the life of your center partition system, what we're really talking about is reducing the damage. At FG Products, we know that most of the damage happens during loading and unloading because of material handling equipment. We've identified a few key areas that if properly addressed can help you get the most out of your center partition system. The first thing we want to do is give material handling equipment plenty of space. FG recommends to store one, two, or even three panels at the side of the trailer. This gives ample room for the material handling equipment to come in, deposit the pallet, and exit without causing any damage to the end panel or to bulkheads or panels along the sidewall. The most important thing you can do to preserve the life of your center partition system panels is to leave the rear reinforced panel in place at all times. FG Products has specifically designed this panel with internal and external reinforcements like the aluminum gusset. This panel can withstand the rigors of everyday loading and unloading abuse. When it comes to minimizing damage to an insulated bulkhead, ideally we want to take the bulkhead out of the vehicle, but that doesn't necessarily mean that it isn't going to get lost or damaged outside of the vehicle. So if you're going to leave it in, please put it to the back of the vehicle along the sidewall and strap it into place. If you only load one side at a time, you can put the bulkhead to the side that you're not loading so that you give 100% of the room to the material handling equipment and no damage will then occur. At FG Products, we know the best way to make our systems better is to rely on feedback from users like you. If you have any comments or suggestions on how FG Products can make our center partition systems even better, please contact your FG sales representative. I hope that what you've seen here today will help you get the best product integrity and the most life out of your center partition system from FG Products.